Hey, Stephen McGrath here. So, yeah, I was online during the week and a friend of mine posted saying that he was trying to save his old Balcony TV performances. And I was thinking, why is he doing that? Like, what's the big problem? They'll be there forever. Or, well, that's what I thought. But it turns out they've all been delisted. So um, it actually happened back in August and I didn't know about it. And I posted on Instagram about it. And it turns out most other people don't know also. So um, I'm just making this video to make people aware of what's going on. And I'm going to show you maybe how you could get your own performances back or at least watch them. I'm not saying you should do it. So, um, yeah, uh, it was Back in TV was founded back in 2006 in Dublin by Stephen O'Regan. And it quickly like blew up from there and went worldwide and um yeah basically it was in every major city if kind of a rite of passage if you were in a band you performed on back in the tv so i found this article on the times.co.uk from last august i think and uh, basically it just says that um stephen sold the the rights to the youtube channel to orchard who are a subsidiary of sony who then decided to delist all the videos so uh you know, Stephen's an entrepreneur and he's entitled to move on after 13 years doing the same thing. But I guess he never thought they'd do this to his his baby. And um, yeah, he said it, there's like estimated 18,000 live performances have been removed from YouTube. That's disgraceful. That's unbelievable. So he said it better than I could say it. So this is what he said. It's a huge body of work that featured artists from all levels all over the world for the past 13 years. I see this as an act of cultural desecration. Yeah, spot on there, Stephen. So why why does it matter? Well, you know, like a lot of these bands have finished up and it's great to have these memories to look back, you know. Oh, remember that time we were on Balcony? And um, not every band gets around to making like great music videos and all these things. So uh, Balcony TV might be one of the only like decently shot and recorded videos they ever had. And then like that, boom, it's gone. So I'm just going to do a quick search on YouTube to see what comes up. Um, if I do search for Balcony TV, um, I'm putting on my browser in incognito mode, right? And I'm going to just type in Balcony TV. Okay, well, get a lot of suggested results, all the different countries where it was popular. Um, let's see what comes up. So we get this, Balcony. So they changed the name of the channel to Balcony. They kept, obviously, they still have 180,000 subscribers. Not bad. Apparently, they have 347 videos. They actually have 18,000 videos, not 347. They have them all delisted. And I have no idea who any of these acts... You're seeing some stuff from Balcony. This is other people put them up on different channels, but they're not the official ones. So, yeah, I don't know how, who these acts are that they're putting on their own channel now. But uh, that's just the story, lads. And basically... They're only delisted, they're not deleted. So if you can grab the link to your video, um, I happen to just have the link to my own band, Crow Black Chicken's performance in Cork. Boom, it's coming up. It should come up. And there it is. Uh, Crow Black Chicken Murmuration in Cork. It's unlisted, but it's there. I can download it. If I wanted to, not saying I will, but I can watch it now anyway. There's nothing against me watching an unlisted video. That's the crack, lads. Hope this helped and uh, I'll see you soon.